I remember him using the props like we had a, a window seal of one foot. The window used to be have a window seal one foot inside in the room. So I remember when he had bad catch in his back, he used that window seal as we use the trestler now, putting his hand on that and turning his back, etc. We had one wooden uh, box, and that wooden box he used as a prop sometimes for back bending action. But when others could not do, uh, he he just pointed out that something with the box like this, if you have got, you can do. So the idea of props was there. You know what the shoulder is doing? So open it. Then, you move the elbows more and more. Take one more. So his teaching method, doing method, all this really he developed, observing himself, what people need, how no, it has to be worked. Learn always that when any patient comes to you, you have to make them to mobile. They have to go on repeating. Mm -hmm. If you keep them too long, the soreness comes. You keep too long. I had watched him teaching people with polio. A girl used to come having this polio problem. And he asked me to bring the garden brick. We had a small garden and he said, pick up that brick and bring it. So I brought that uh, brick. I was not knowing what he is exactly going to do with that brick. But then he placed it between the ankles and asked that girl to hold. She was a South Indian girl having the polio. Then handkerchief he tied because the foot was dropping. So he had that big handkerchief uh, and he tied it to feet and the brick. And that I remember very well. 